Why are there balloons in Receiver 2? Well, I finally got a tape that explains it. In a new technique that allows... While we have been unable to match the threat in their ability to dream items into being, we have, however, recently been successful in a new technique that allows us to transfer an object from one place to another. Receivers have created caches of objects that will act as a resource for this after the mind kill. That's it. Balloons are caches of resource. Which resource? Bullets. In order to prevent the threat from remotely viewing the caches and, and tampering with them, we are unable to divulge the details of the items they contain. But trust, you will be able to identify them when you see them. After the mind kill, these will act as a psychological cue to remind you that you are not alone. Because it's a party. So these things can be popped for bullets. Uh, let's confirm this. Yeah, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bullets at the top left. Eight bullets. All right, got all three with one shot. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, and then one, two, three. We got six bullets out of this. Uh, it is my impression that some of these balloons contain only one bullet, and if you're lucky, two. So it's always worth giving them a shot, unless you don't think you can hit them. Then it is a small risk, but it is also a great way to train your ability to aim. So give it a go, shoot a balloon today, get some ammo, and no... It is a sign of hope. Until next time, check out my other Receiver 2 videos. Ciao!